Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence and continue standing through our national anthem. I have heard a couple of times on how people are loving listening to the stories and starting that voting. You guys have all this week to vote, and I will pull the results on Friday. I know there are still a couple of links that are not on there, so just give Ms. Kafka a, a, just a day or two to get that done, and I will get those last books linked, but I hope you are enjoying all of the other books. Good morning, GSES staff and students. I am Mrs. Sun, and it is Mindset Monday. We're still on the sixth mindset, which is live to give, and we're on 6.3, which is receive gracefully. Well, what does that mean? Well, it means if someone gives you something, then you accept it with gratitude, telling them thank you, maybe writing them a thank you note, just letting them know how thankful you are for what they gave you. Accept compliments. If someone compliments you, just say thank you and receive it gracefully. And generosity goes both ways. So when someone gives you something or says something nice to you, just say thank you. So it's always better to give than receive, but we need to know how to receive receive things gracefully. Also, acknowledge someone's time or the risk they took to give you something. Again, making sure you say thank you 
Um, and just maybe writing them a thank you note if you can, or drawing them a picture, just making sure they realize that you appreciate what they've done for you. I am going to tell you a quote that I like in the Live to Give chapter. It says, A candle loses nothing by lighting another candle. So the Live to Give, give to others and receive gracefully. As always, I hope you make it the best week yet. Be kind, work hard, be honest, and receive gracefully. See you around. Mwah. Good morning, Positive Panthers. This is Miss Landers and Miss Bray, and we are so excited to talk through more pause expectations here at Gum Springs. This week's edition covers the playground, our favorite place, of course. As you watch today's video, be on the lookout to see if you can find some good examples and some not so good examples of pause expectations. That's right, and everyone knows P is for pride. Miss Landers, how can we show pride on the playground? Well, you know it's our playground. To, to, show, to show pride on the playground, we need to make sure we take care of it, like throwing our trash away, collecting all our belongings, and making sure that we're doing the right thing on the equipment. Yes, and A is for attitude. Hmm, how can we display a good attitude on the playground? Well, the playground's one of the best places to make friends. So we need to make sure that we always are being kind to others. That's how we can have a pause attitude. Yes, and W is for work. Hmm, boys and girls, and Miss Landers, how do you think we can show good work habits on the playground? Well, it's kind of tricky because this is where we go to play, right? Well, that is what our work is, play. So we need to make sure that we are sharing and taking turns and playing kindly. Yep, and the last one, the most important, S is for safety. Okay, so how can we stay safe on the playground? That's right, safety is the most important, especially with our new equipment. So in order to stay safe, we need to use it correctly. Make sure only the little kids are using the swings and the big kids are using the big swings. Make sure you're take, making good choices on our new equipment as well. Yes. So boys and girls, we cannot wait to see how many dojo points you earn on the playground this week, especially that new equipment showing us that you know how to use it correctly. And remember, you can also earn points for your tribe. So go out there and work hard. And have a positively great week, Panthers. Now go earn some tribe points. <laughs> Just so you guys know, we did finally complete our map last week. I can't believe it. We got those last three states in on Friday. Way to go, Panthers. We have a lot of family and friends across this United States, don't we? P-A-W-S, P-A-W-S, P-A-W-S. G-S, E-S, pause, check it out and listen. These things need our attention, pride, attitude, work, and safety. Live in our halls every day, leave first things first, follow directions. Look, don't touch, in transition, remain seated, clean your space. When we eat, manners are great. Use good bathroom behavior, flush, you know it will save you. Respect others' privacy, come on y'all, it's just got to be. Be kind and share your things, play outside carefully, yo. At the end of the day, P-A-W-S all the way. P-A-W-S, 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 at G-S, 